do 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 waiting at McDonald's for a McCafe, even though McCafe is just the name of McDonald's' whole coffee brand and not just, you know, a particular name for their coffee. But uh, we were like, you know, really young back then. Who gives a shit? Good morning, sir, and welcome to McDonald's. And yes, I am a legit McDonald's employee, if you can tell from my shirt. I have several questions, but... Yeah, uh, I would like to get a McCafe. Oh, so you want our entire coffee section? Okay, that'll be a thousand dollars. No, 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 no. I just want a coffee. Oh, okay, that's very easy. Why am I here? Oh, uh, one crap. I, are, are you kidding me? I thought you guys don't serve seafood. Well, we did have the McLobster, but this is close enough, right? I asked for coffee. All right, okay, I'll be right back. Wait, how can you even lift me up? Oh, one dragon, sir. <laughs> okay, th this is getting ridiculous. I just wanted coffee. Oh, coffee. Okay, okay. Uh, Yeah, sorry, we don't have any coffee. Uh, what? Okay, you know what? Never mind. Oh my god, I see all of these zucchinis, but where are my phone? Wait, where is my phone? Darn it. Oh my lord, I see all these zucchinis, but where is my phone? Fun fact, by the way, when we made the Let's Put 97 channel 10 years ago, we actually made an annoying orange ripoff called the Annoying Zucchini, and yours truly was being annoyed by it. Fun fact for you guys. Oh, where's my phone? Where's my phone, donkey? If you couldn't tell, back then I was a ripoff of Shrek from Super Mario Logan. Screw the phone. I'm gonna eat all this sugar, because why not? I don't care whatsoever about my teeth, and I don't care if I get diabetes. <laughs> I'm all of a sudden hyper all of a sudden, even though that doesn't actually happen when you eat sugar immediately. <laughs> oh, Snoopy, I'm gonna touch Libby yet. Oh. That's right. <laughs> Snoopy, hey, hey, I'm sorry for bringing that up. Okay, uh, moving on. <laughs> I'm gonna push E.T. off this cliff because I'm an asshole. <laughs> well, you actually are supposed to be an asshole. Ouch! <laughs> okay, you two, we're gonna need to find a way to stop Cartman from acting so hyper. Wait, I just realized something, Stan. What's that, E.T.? Didn't this plot in some way got recycled for season 7? Oh, yeah, the expired Cartman episode. I, I didn't even realize until now how similar those, um... The plots were. I guess that explains why you mean Snoopy were in it. Me 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 me. All right. Well, anyways, let's stop Carbon. Oh no! I've been defeated. Ow. Speaking of Super Mario Logan ripoffs, let's rip off Toad's mistake. <laughs> Ding. <laughs> I see you've chosen death. <laughs> Why am I a huge deal, you may ask? Well, since you touched my valuable object, definitely not a rip off of Super Mario Logan, since you touched it, I'm gonna be a running gag throughout the rest of the series where I get to kill you. Mmm, <laughs> looks like I'm eating cheese crackers, even though the bag is like completely sealed. Uh, hey, Carmen, there's apparently a rule now where you can't eat cheese crackers early in the morning, so... Yeah, I would advise you to stop. That's a ridiculous rule, Kyle. I'm just gonna continue eating these. I'm gonna be a tattletale and tell on Carmen. Stop it right there, young boy. You are under arrest. And I am clearly a cop, as you can tell from my uniform. Huh? You don't look like a cop to me. Shut up, man. I'm taking you to jail. Wait, what? This is ridiculous, and people say the cops that we have nowadays are jerks. I'm just minding my own business, eh? <gasps> Wait a minute. This is not Mountain Dew throwback. We're on a budget. But, uh, I hope it's not been discontinued. No, it's still being made. Oh, okay. Um, oh, definitely a bottle of Mountain Dew throwback. I'm just gonna keep saying, oh yeah, for the rest of my life until I die. Oh yeah. Hey, Kyle. I got a good idea that's clearly original. Oh, what's that, Stan? I say we rip off SpongeBob the Great Snail Race. Oh, that's a great idea. I got my pet right here, Kyle. Wait, if this is like a pet race, wouldn't he have like an unfair advantage with his wings? Oh, don't worry. I've trained him to not, um, fly because apparently that's what you can easily do with birds. Rock! 
I can walk. Rah! Seems legit. Um, de dum de dum de dum. Hello, you two. My name is Rodney, and apparently this is the only time in the show where I've ever appeared as a bad guy. But anyways, here is the dog that I'm going to be using for this pet race. Your lovely girlfriend, Donna Stan. Wait, 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 wait. Hold the phone. Stop the recording. What? What's the matter, Stan? Wait, you're... Okay, redo. Anyways, what's the problem, Kyle? You're telling me you dated Donna at some point? Come on, man. We were all there when that happened. Awkward! Yeah, even... I will admit, even though we were, um... The dating 10 years ago, it was really awkward. A human and a dog. <laughs> okay, everybody, time to get ready for the pet race. And yes, I am using myself as the announcer because why not? And I'm just going to re uh, repeat every single line that the announcer said in the actual SpongeBob episode, The Great Snail Race. Heck, if any of you guys really want to know what happens next, just watch that episode rather than watching this. Oh god, I love this couch. I feel very disturbed while watching this, Stan. I couldn't agree with you more, Kyle. Guys, let me tell you something. I'm gonna marry this couch. What the hell? You can't marry a couch. I could do whatever I want, boys. It doesn't even matter. Me and her are gonna get married. How do you know it's a she? Hello, boys. I am back to being a cop. Same police uniform as always. Weren't you also working at McDonald's? Shh. Oh, God, not you again. Yes, boy, you are under arrest for trying to marry an inanimate object. And you're like 10 years old. What the hell? How many years should I put him in jail for, Kyle? Well, I'm going to steal a quote from Jimmy Neutron. Put him in jail for 10 trillion more years. You got it. Well, I'm not even going to live that long. I don't care. It, ow, ow, my arm. Do you always have to use your mouth? Yes. Ah. Today's episode of TCW has been brought to you by the word unoriginal. Hello, everybody. Hopefully you all made it to the end of the episode, but hopefully you all enjoyed. This was a little um, a tribute uh, uh, to the 10 year anniversary of our very first YouTube channel, which was called Let's Pray 7, which, um, by the way, the TCW pilots, which were like our first seven videos on this channel, they were videos that were originally on that channel, so we decided in honor of the 10th anniversary of that channel, we decided to do little recreations, and I guess in some ways making fun of, you know, a lot of the flaws that um, those videos had, because let's face it, they suck. Let's be real. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, stay tuned for whatever else is going to happen with this show. We've got four more episodes left of season 14, so hopefully you're looking forward to those. And yeah, I am going to, you know, leave and uh, I guess throw a party in honor of the 10th anniversary. I have a feeling only five people are actually going to show up at that party since, uh, fun fact, we only had like five subscribers when um, we had that Let's Put 97 channel, but yeah, 